Hi guys, I'm scouting out some new locations in a different town. And I'm here at Dollar Tree. And I've pulled out one bag and I'm gonna poke through it and see what's there. And then there's one more bag that looks like flowers. So let's see if there's anything salvageable in this bag. There is a picture frame with the glass broken. Got a chip in it. Plastic bowl. Got a little crack in it. Um, maybe able to salvage that with some rocks. We like rocks. Oh, plastic tablecloths. We like those. Um, some kind of flowery lay. Take that. I don't know there. Uh, sunglasses, we'll take those. And, sorry about all the jumbling. Um, squishy ball. Squishy, squishy. That's kind of cute. Um, little vase. Um, not gonna take any kind of, um, wine glasses, broken or not, because I just got rid of a bunch. I just donated a bunch. There's some little glass bowls. I'll take those. And a Gatorade. I'll take that. Um, looks like that's about it. So I'll get the flowers out, and then I'll see you at the next stop. Still on my scouting trip. There's some employees over there, so I've got to be real careful. But I can see a bag of dog food right there. And I'm gonna try my best to get it. Maybe two bags. I figured they're on a smoke break and they shouldn't be there too long. So, um, yeah, wish me luck. Okay, I've already found a couple of things here. So I am coming to look a little closer. that there were. I'll show you what I found and why I kind of got a little bit excited. There's two of them. See the price on there? Yeah. And, um, they were just sitting right on top. So, um, I may have to just put you down and look to see if I can find any more over there. And then there's a couple more dumpsters in this whole area. So I'm just gonna peek at all of them and wish me luck. Like I said, I'm scouting out a new area in another town to just see how things are here. Okay, went back once I put you down and found these. Look at those price tags. Two of those. So. Whew, I know this is going to be pieced together because I, um, I'm kind of scared about being caught. Let's see if I can... Okay, there's someone over there at the next door, so I'm whispering. Let's see if I can put you there. And if you can see... Okay.
for a GNC score like this in my town and they never put out anything after the first time I found some protein powders that were used as samples and um, damaged out uh, ones that were damaged out and ones that were samples not the same thing I've been looking for something like this and couldn't find it and now I'm in this other town an employee came up and so I had to leave but the score is so big I I'm okay to have been stopped and uh, I'll check back in a little bit and see if they're gone and then um, maybe come back. So I got two of these at $49.99, men's, multi-release, powered, super male tee, whatever that is. This, two of these, $74.99, uh, $74.99, <laughs> super male tee, male performance. I don't know what these are. I guess it's for men's workouts. Now this box down here accidentally opened up as I was pulling out a bag and so all the contents came out and I was just kind of fishing them out um, to put them back in and that's for women's women's ultra mega whole body that's just multi-pack and it is full and its price was $64.99 all right I've got oh I think two or three of these uh, $1.99 and marked down to $99 and they're just uh, performance drinks and then I've got a couple of these um, carb killer high protein bars my hubby needs these because he needs protein there's some more of these that come in there um, protein cake bites and then there's uh, egg white peanuts and half of a date uh, maybe my son will take those honey cinnamon and peanut butter Hubby and I uh, try to stay vegan as much as possible. He will eat meat or cheese once in a while. And once in a while I'll have cheese, just lately. Before before that, this last two years, I, I hadn't had any meat or cheese or anything. So anyway, that's a, I guess, a drink mix. And then there's another one uh, that's peanut butter flavor. And this one is honey cinnamon peanut butter. Okay, and then another one of the Carbzilla. So that's three of those. And then this is Sports Beans Quick Energy. And then one bag that was priced $5.99 of flax meal. And being vegan, I use this because this is where I get my omega-3s. Um, there's another box of these women's whole health that wasn't open. Okay. And then don't know what this is. Cuprazine A, it's a herbal supplement for memory retention and function, and it's vegetarian, so that's actually good. Uh, price was $8.99, and I've got, looks like three bottles down here. And then this Super Male Tea, that's some more of this, it's in the box, it looks like a smaller package of it. And um, some more of those. And then, um, Eucagard Plus, cl clinically advanced support for optimum eye health. Do you remember, um, well, you may not remember. That's my other channel, sorry. I have three channels, guys. My husband has just been diagnosed with macular degeneration. Uh, we buy these online at a much lower price for just a few in a bottle. And this is 120 capsules at $30.99, and this is absolutely perfect for him because this is what the eye doctor subscribed, this exact formula. So absolutely perfect score there. Um, beta cytosterol. Um, don't know what that is. It says Source Naturals. Um, hmm. Soybean holes. And I don't know what else. It's calcium. Okay, it's calcium. There we go. All right, a whole box of, sorry, let me get my grabber out of the way before I drop this whole box of, of these, um, it's just a different flavor. No, that's an actual bar. These are powders. This is a bar, but it says the same stuff as those. Okay, and then that's another bar, different flavor of that. So, you can see all over the floor, all of the stuff. This was actually open. Don't know if that's safe or not. All the pills are there. They did dump out, it looks like, half of the things that they were putting in and half of them they, they didn't. So, 
Um, I find that the same thing with my CVS in town. It looks like one employee will trash everything and then the next employee will come down behind them and just put stuff in whole. So it's just a matter of getting the right employee's trash. <laughs> So, um, don't worry about this bag. Um, I dumped some stuff at Salvation Army. All the things that I've been collecting that I didn't need, I donate to Salvation Army. And let me just say a word about that. Um, Goodwill is not charity. They may give to charities, but they are not themselves a charity. They are billionaires and they have made their fortune on donations because people think they are charity they're given to charity okay salvation army you may or may not believe in their views because they are highly christian i don't believe in that part of them but they are charity and they do good things so if i give and a lot of the dumpster stuff that i pull out that are goods and not uh food that's where i take them so any clothes any little knickknacks um um, I think I even pulled some stuff out of tractor supply that were parts for things. That's where I put them. Okay, so um, have a good, good day. Love you very much. Please like and subscribe and um, have a wonderful day, guys. So I was really curious at how much I actually pulled out of that GNC dumpster. And I had estimated in my mind around $500. And when I got home and I wrote it all down and I tallied it all up, $642.01. Boy, was this a score. And remember guys, this wasn't my only dumpster of the day. All right, we have plants. They are still alive. A whole bunch of them and they are coming home with the mama there's a watermelon up there probably no good but these plants are still alive guys and a whole case of water why do people throw away water that's just aggravating I don't buy bottled water won't do it refuse to do it but that's just aggravating all right here we go okay here's what we got one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen plants. Some of them are in very good condition and still very much alive. And some of them have got, um, see, these are all really, really good. And some of them are like this, where there's some that's really alive and then some, some really dry spots. So we'll see what we can do with them. But all in all, most of these are in really, really good shape. We got um, three rolls of toilet paper. Well, I don't know why that pack was open. And then um, we got out that case of water. One bottle looked like it was leaking from the top and they just threw the whole case away. Because of course the pack is to sell in a package. And then we stopped by the shoe store and pulled out one pair of used running shoes. They were a trade-in, of course. But you know what? They've got a lot of tread on them. They're not very dirty. They're Nike. They're my husband's and my son's size. And I think I can wash them and I think I can make them very usable and nice shoes. So um, all in all, it's been a really good day. The car is completely full. And so we are going to go home. We'll check at CVS before we go because, you know, that's our thing. That's what we do. All right. Have a good day, guys. Please do like and share. And if you're not subscribed yet, please do. Okay. I'm here at CVS. There's a couple of things worth checking. I can see some sunscreen right here. This is in a really nasty bag. And I didn't bring gloves or... Um, bags or anything in here with me because there hasn't been anything lately. Ooh, rapid wrinkle beef repair. That's what mama needs. Look, there's our gloves from last week. <laughs> the girls had got so nasty dirty that I told them to take their gloves off and just throw them in. Yeah, Ole Regenerous. Yep. This old lady needs these products. 
don't know if you guys realize, but I am in my 50s. Oh yeah, sheer zinc, yeah. And this is most definitely something I need. And you know what, hands wash, revital lift. nastiest bag there ever was, but it's exactly what I've been needing. There's some more sunscreen. Oh, ultra sheer lotion, 55. Um, daily fiber, yes. Huge box of that. Thanks for checking out CVS with me. Okay, I got that other um, bag out. There were two packs of cold remedy and an arm sling, some batteries. Oh, three packs of cold remedy. Um, acid reducer, whole box of fi Benefiber on the go, the little bitty packs. They were dumped out, but I picked them back up because they are sealed in their packages. And two packs of hot dog buns. So that's it for CVS for today. And this is what I've been waiting for, guys, truly, is I needed face moisturizer and, and I got some. So I've been kind of manifesting exactly what I need lately. And it's a wonderful feeling. The universe is taking care of me.